हेलो नमस्कार टू द ऑल केमिस्ट्री लवर्स एंड द डॉक्टर्स ऑफ इंजीनियर एंड इंजीनियर्स ऑफ द न्यू फ्यूचर एज पर नॉर्म्स एज पर कमिटमेंट मैं आपके सामने फिर से हाजिर हुआ हूँ नेक्स्ट वीडियो के साथ में एज अ कोऑर्डिनेशन केमिस्ट्री के रिगार्डिंग हमने प्रीवियस वीडियो में डिस्कस किया फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल की कॉर्डिनेशन केमिस्ट्री में का मीनिंग क्या है फादर ऑफ कॉर्डिनेशन केमिस्ट्री कौन है जस्ट सॉल्ट क्या है सॉल्ट के टाइप्स पढ़े और कॉम्प्लेक्स कंपाउंड को कॉर्डिनेट कंपाउंड को कहते हैं वो भी पढ़ा उसके साथ साथ ये भी हमने डिस्कस किया कि पर्टिकुलर कॉम्प्लेक्स कंपाउंड के फॉर्मेशन में डी ब्लॉक एलिमेंट्स ही पार्टिसिपेट क्यों करते हैं आज मैं बात करना चाहूँगा स्ट्रक्चर और कॉम्प्लेक्स कंपाउंड के अलॉन्ग नेक्स्ट पार्ट दैट इज कॉल्ड एज लिगेन सो दिस इज द कॉर्डिनेशन केमिस्ट्री के रिगार्डिंग दिस इज योर लिगेंस वट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ लिगेंस बात करूं तो सो वी कैन से एटम और ग्रुप ऑफ एटम एटम और ग्रुप ऑफ एटम विच डोनेट्स विच डोनेट्स लॉन पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन लॉन पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन दो जान नोन है जस्ट लिगेंस लॉन पेयर डोनेट कर रहे हैं एसिड बेस्ट स्टोरीज हम लोग डिस्कस कर चुके हैं लो स्टैंडर्ड में कि बेसिकली आर ही थ्योरी है ब्रॉसेड लॉरी थ्योरी है लिवाइस थ्योरी है तो लिवाइस थ्योरी ये कहती है कि अगर लॉन पे डोनेट कर रहा है देन देर नेचर विल बी नेचर विल बी एज अ लिवाइस बेस लिवाइस बेस तो उस पोजीशन में सेंट्रल मेटल आइटम इलेक्ट्रॉन गेन कर रहा है लॉन पे गेन कर रहा है तो सेंट्रल मेटल आइटम की नेचर सेंट्रल मेटल एटम की नेचर आपके पास में होगी लिवाइस एसिड और लिवाइस एसिड और बेस मिलकर के सॉल्ट का फॉर्मेशन करते हैं दस कॉम्प्लेक्स सॉल्ट इफ यू गो विद द एग्जांपल ऑफ द लिगेंस देन वी कैन टेक एज एग्जांपल सी एल माइनस बी आर माइनस आई माइनस मे बी एज ए पॉजिटिवली चार्ज एन एच फोर प्लस एनओ टू प्लस मे एज जस्ट न्यूट्रल एज अ एच टू ओ एन एस थ्री ई एन ई डी टी ए ई डी टी ए थ्री माइनस एंड ई डी टी ए फोर माइनस दीज ऑल आर एज अ जस्ट एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ द लीगल इफ यू गो विद द फर्दर देन टाइप्स ऑफ लीगल लिगेंस के टाइप की बात डिस्कस करेंगे टाइप्स ऑफ लिगेंस इफ यू गो विद जस्ट डोनर कैपेसिटी मींस उस लिगेंस में कितने नंबर ऑफ डोनर आइटम है उसके बेस पे लिगेंस के फोर टाइप्स होंगे सो विल से ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ नंबर ऑफ डोनर आइटम डोनर आइटम के नंबर के बेस पे देर आर फोर टाइप्स ऑफ द लिगेन फोर टाइप्स नंबर वन इज योर मोनो डेंटेट लिगेन मोनो डेंटेट लिगेन नंबर टू बाई और डाई डेंटेट लिगेंस डेंटेट लिगेंस नंबर थ्री इज योर पोली डेंटेट लिगेंस पोली डेंटेट लिगेंस and final is your mp or you can call it mb dentate ligands so chemistry lovers and students there are four kinds of the ligands monodentate ligands having one donor atom in chemistry bi means having two donor atom poly means having three or more than three donor atom and mp dentate having Two donor atom, more than one donor atom, or means we can say that two donor atom, but at a time only one atom donates lone pair of electron. Is that clear?
so so now we'll go with the just first of all just mono dentate again this is the mono dentate ligand first type of the ligand mono means having one so you can say having one donor atom donor atom those are known as monodentate ligand these may as negative positive and neutral type of the ligand type of the ligand means particular monodentate ligand negative charge ho sakta hai positive charge ho sakta hai aur neutral bhi ho sakta hai first of all uh, we'll go with the just negatively charged negatively charged monodentate ligand monodentate ligands negatively charged having negative charge so you can say monodentate ligand monodentate ligands having just negative charge ऐसे लिगेंड जो कि पर्टिकुलर मोनोडेंटेड हो दोनों आइटम वन हो बट उनपे चार्ज नेगेटिव हो तो नेगेटिवली चार्ज मोनोडेंटेड लिगेंड जब भी इनका नॉमन क्लीचर करेंगे तो ड्यूरिंग नॉमन क्लीचर नॉमन क्लीचर इट विल यूज ऑफ यूज ऑफ सफिक्स सफिक्स ओ इनिशियल में बी ओ यूज होता था बट अब सफिक्स ओरिजिनल नेम के साथ में ओ यूज करते हैं पहले आई एट आई इनको रिमूव करते थे बट नाउ डेज ऑरिजिनल नेम जो है नेगेटिवली चार्ज स्पीसी का उसके साथ ओ ऐड कर देते हैं फॉर एग्जांपल विल टेक अलॉट ऑफ एग्जांपल दिस इज द सीरियल नंबर दिस इज द लिगेन दिस इज द नेम एंड दिस इज द चार्ज चार्ज इज इंपॉर्टेंट ऑल्सो name is important also and if we'll go with the serial number then first of all we'll start with the h minus second is your f minus third is your cl minus fourth is your br minus fifth is your i minus sixth is your cl minus seventh is your nc minus first is your this is called as hydride so the name will be hydrido this is the fluoride so it is called as fluorido this is chloride so the name will be chlorido this is the bromide name will be bromido this is iodide so it will be iodo this is the cyanide it is called as cyanido and you can call it cyano also cyano also this is the isocyanido ya isocyano isocyanido or you can call it isocyano if we'll go with the charge it has this minus 1 minus 1 minus 1 minus 1 this is your minus 1 minus 1 and minus 1 so dear student it's required to learn their charge also because of it is helpful to know the oxidation state of the central metal atom so this was some of the example regarding to just negatively charged monodentate ligands now next monodentate ligands are uh, just you can say this is your eighth we can take oh minus ninth is your you can take as a minus ch3coo minus 
10th you can take n o2 minus 11th you can take o n o minus this is the minus charge it is called as hydroxo hydroxo or suffix this is the acetato this is the nitro this is the nitrito charge is your again minus 1 minus 1 minus 1 and minus 1 now we'll go with the just ligands having minus 2 charge then we can take this is the 12 is your co3 2 minus 13 is your s2 minus 14 is your so3 2 minus 15 is your so4 2 minus 16 is your s2 o3 2 minus this is known as carbonato charge is your minus 2 this is your sulfido because it is called as sulfide so sulfido minus 2 this is sulfito minus 2 this is your sulfato charge minus 2 this is your thiosulfato thiosulfato charge is your minus 2 as a carbonato sulfato sulfido sulfato sulfate sulfido sulfito ya yeah, sulfito sulfato and thiosulfato if we will go with the further then this is the 17th it's very important uh, we can take just as a minus 3 charge n minus 3 and before n minus 3 we will take the important example o minus 2 18 is your o2 minus 2 this is called as oxo charge is minus 2 this is known as per oxo charge is again minus 2 this was about the just minus 2 charge ligand now i would like to go with the next 19 what is that that is your n minus 3 this is your 20 p minus 3 this is called as nitrido yeah you can say azido also charge is your minus 3 this is your phosphido charge is your minus 3 so this was about the regarding negatively charged monodentic ligand now i would like to go with the positively charged monodentic ligand here is this is the positively charged monodentic ligand positively charged mono dentate ligands you can say just positively charged so monodentate ligand mono dentate ligands having monodentate ligands having positive charge they are known as positively charged monodentate ligands if you will go with the nomenclature then during nomenclature during nomenclature of such ligands it will use of suffix ium i u m which means e m it will use of suffix just i u m this is the e m example as an example if you can take just your no 2 plus this is the n h 4 plus this is the n o plus this is the fourth you can take nh2 this is the ns3 plus it's made up of from hydrazine ns2 and ns2 student remember one thing most of the people most of the student think it's a bidentate ligand because donor atom 2 hai but it's a monodentate because of at a time ek nitrogen donate karega aur dusra lon pe yahan shift karega usko stability dene ka kaam karega so it's not a bidentate ligand it's a monodentate ligand important baat aapko learn karne layak hai 
this is the name is nitro neum because suffix ium use ho raha hai charge is your plus 1 this is ammonium ammonium this is the charge as a plus 1 this is the nitrosonium nitrosonium charge is your plus 1 and this is the hydrogenium because it is made up of from hydrazine hydrazine jab ek particular hydrazine particular ek proton ko gain karega to ye hydrogenium ka formation hoga and it's a hydrazine is a monodentate ligand and hydrogenium is also monodentate ligand aur aap sab ko inka donor atom bhi learn rakhna hai so this was about the just negatively charged ligand as a monodentate and this was about the positively charged monodentate ligand is that clear so now the time to discuss about the just we have discussed about the negatively charged and positively charged monodentate ligand now the time to discuss about neutral monodentate ligand so this is the neutral mono dentate ligands you can say monodentate ligands having no charge mono mono dentate ligands having no charge means in par particular ko charge nahi hota khas baat nomenclature for such ligands nomenclature will be specific inka nomenclature bhi specific hoga beta ji kaise for example as a example we can take first of all s2 no charge means during calculation of oxidation state in ka oxidation state aapko zero lena hai baki sab ke liye jo jaisa charge hai waisa aapko oxidation number so this is the ns3 this is the third co fourth cs fifth this is your c5 h5 n it is its structure is as follows it's a heterocyclic compound as follows this is the ph3 and this is the ph whole thrice p means in tino hydrogen ka removal kar diya with the help of phenyl group isko aap yun bhi show kar sakte hain this is the c6h5 whole thrice p the name its name is aqua its name is amine a double m i n e नेम का बड़ा ध्यान रखें दिस इज द कार्बोनाइल दिस इज द थायो कार्बोनाइल थायो कार्बोनाइल दिस इज द पीरिडीन पीरिडीन दिस इज द फॉस्फीन फॉस्फीन दिस इज द ट्राई फिनाइल फॉस्फीन ट्राई फिनाइल फॉस्फीन If we we'll go with the further, then we can take just a lot of example, but these are the very important example for the just coordination chemistry. So this was about the just neutral monodentate ligand. Is that clear? now we'll go with the bidentate ligand or didentate ligand it's very important this is the bi this is the bi dentate or di 
dentate ligands by means to so you can say ligands having having two donor atoms two donor atoms they all are known as bidentate or didentate ligands if we'll go with the charge then these may as neutral neutral and negatively charged neutral and negatively charged means along the nature these may be as a neutral and negatively charged but it may not as a positive charge so if we'll go with the example then first of all we'll go with the neutral as a neutral we'll take en it is called as ethylene diamine but according to ipc system uh, we can call it just ethane 1 2 diamine ethane 1 2 diamine also if we go with the structure then this is the ch2 this is your ch2 ns2 and ns2 donor atom ko hum log star se denote karenge so this is the nitrogen this is the nitrogen charge is again zero charge is zero there is no charge if we go with the another then this is the di pi you can call it di pyridyl di pyridyl here have been two pyridine ring as a donor atom like this this is the nitrogen one of the pyridine ring this is the another pyridine ring this is the donor atom nitrogen and nitrogen again charge is charge is again zero this was regarding to en and this was regarding to di pi if i'll go with the further then we can take another example as a third example what are they this is your gly in many of sheet or just books it will be small or it may be capital also gly means glycinato glycinato i am going to explain you one of the important thing ek important thing batane ja raha hu aapko ki glycinato ka structure jo hai ye glycinato develop hua hai glycine amino aml se glycine amino aml means sorry you can say just glycine amino acid it's a amino acid you all know just there are 20 types of amino acid in human body in between them 10 of are just essential amino acid and you can say 10 of are as a non essential amino acid 10 are as a essential amino acid and 10 of are just non amino non essential amino acid so glycinato is one of the non essential amino acid and the structure is your this is the structure of glycine ns2 cs2 co o and h if i remove this one of the hydrogen then here will formation of glycinato and the charge is your you can see just minus one due to oxygen and donor atom are one of the nitrogen and one of the oxygen atom this was regarding to just glycinato another example as a fourth ligand by dentate we can take ox 2 minus or c2o4 2 minus this is known as oxalato this is known as oxalato oxalato is formed by a oxalic acid this is the cooh and cooh if we we'll go with the oxalato then after the removal of these two hydrogen here will formation of oxalato this is the minus this is the o and this is the o minus charge is your again minus 1 and minus 1 minus 2 this is the charge for oxalato donor atom it will be one of the oxygen another oxygen charge is minus 2 another important example uh, we can take just that is very important that is called as dmg it is known as di 
मिथाइल ग्लाई ऑक्जीमेटो ऑक्जीमेटो ओ दैन इट्स अ नेगेटिव लिगेन सो डाई मिथाइल ग्लाई ऑक्जीमेटो स्ट्रक्चर विल बी सी एस थ्री दिस इज सी दिस इज सी एस थ्री डबल बोन एन दिस इज द ओ एंड एच दिस इज डबल बोन एन एंड दिस इज ओ लॉन्ग पेयर विल बी एज फॉलोज माइनस डोनर एटम नाइट्रोजन एट जस्ट हेयर विल ऑल्सो डोनर एटम एज अ नाइट्रोजन बट चार्ज इज योर माइनस वन सो दिस इज द चार्ज एज अ माइनस वन सो दिस वॉज रिगार्डिंग टू जस्ट योर बाई डेंटिटली गेंट एज अ ई एन ई थे वन टू डाई मीन जस्ट डाई पाई डाई पेरीडाइल और डाई पेरीडीन जस्ट डी एल वाई ग्लाइसिनेटो इट्स अगेन इट फॉर्म बाय द जस्ट ग्लाइसी अमीनो एसिड वेयर इट इज नॉन असेंशियल अमीनो एसिड एंड दिस इज द वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट फॉर यू ट्वेंटी अमीनो एसिड आर प्रेजेंट इन आर बॉडी वेयर टेन ऑफ आर असेंशियल एंड टेन ऑफ आर नॉन असेंशियल असेंशियल मीन विच आर रिक्वायर्ड इन आर बॉडी बट दीज डोंट फॉर्म्स इन आर बॉडी दे विल नॉट एनी काइंड ऑफ दिस इंटेसिस इन आर बॉडी इट शुड बी टेकन इन द फॉर्म ऑफ डिफरेंट फूड कंटामेंट्स और टेन नॉन असेंशियल अमीनो एसिड मीन्स पर्टिकुलर इनका बॉडी में फॉर्मेशन होता बट दे आर नॉट रिक्वायर्ड If you we'll go with the OX, then oxalato having the charge minus two formed by the oxalic acid. This is the oxalic acid. If you will go with the further, then that is your DMG dimethyl glyoxime. So it is so it is called as dimethyl glyoximeter because it exists negative charge. This is the structure and donor atom. Is that clear? so now we time to discuss about the polydentate ligand if we'll go with the third type of the ligands then those are known as poly dentate ligands also poly means more than two so you can say having more than two donor atom donor atom those are known as the polydentate ligands so first of all as a polydentate ligand we'll go with the just try dentate ligand try dentate ligand you can say try means just having three donor atom three donor atom if we'll go with the example as a try dentate ligand then we can take example of di e n its full form is your diethylene diethylene triamine diethylene triamine structure is your cs2 this is the cs2 nh this is the you can take cs2 ch2 this is your ns2 and this is your ns2 donor atom 1 nitrogen donor atom 2 nitrogen donor atom 3 again nitrogen charge is just zero this is the one of the just example of as a tridentate ligand if we we'll go with the another example then we can take that is your second example as a terpy terpy means terpyridyl terpyridyl in previous just section or screen we have discussed about the dipy that is your dipy means dipyridyl it's a terpy terpyridyl means three pyridine ring this will be as follows this is the one of the pyridine ring this is the another pyridine ring and this is the another third pyridine ring like this and and these are the 
these will attach by this this is the attachment by this so double bond alternate donor atom nitrogen donor atom again it will be nitrogen charge is your zero donor atom one nitrogen two nitrogen and three nitrogen if we'll go with the further then we can take example third example as a tridentate ligand also we can say amino amino diacetate also amino diacetate also what is that this is the n h this is the cs2 coo donor atom this is the negative charge one of the donor atom two donor atom and this is the cs2 co this is the o negative as a donor atom so there are three donor atom that's why it's a tridentate ligand charge is your charge is your you can say minus one and minus one this is the minus two so this was about the just tridentate ligand having three donor atom as a diene terpi and amino diacetate is that clear now i would like to go second type of the just polydentate ligand that is your tetra tetra dentate ligands tetra dentate ligands you can say having donor atom donor atom as a four if we'll go with the tetra dentate ligand we can take example of first tri en this is the best example tri en full form is tri ethylene tri ethylene tetra amine this is the tetra amine structure is as follows this is the ch2 ch2 this is the nh nh this is your again ch2 ch2 and ns2 and here will also ch2 ch2 and n s2 so this is your lone pair lone pair lone pair as a donor atom so there are four donor atom 1 2 3 4 as a charge charge will be minus no charge because of its a neutral ligand there is no charge this was about the tri en another we can take second nitrile nitrilo triacetato nitrilo triacetato nitrilo triacetato its structure is as follows this is the n this is the ch2 coo this is the one of the donor atom with the charge negative this is the ch2 coo again negative charge this is the ch2 coo this is the negative charge and this is the lone pair so donor atom is 1 2 3 and 4 and if we'll go with the charge then charge is minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 so this was about the just tetra dentate ligand as a tri en and just nitrilo triacetato is that clear now regarding to just polydentate ligand we'll go with the third type of the polydentate ligand as a penta dentate ligand 
pentadentate ligands means having donor atom as a 5 5 donor atom for this we will go with the example EDTA EDTA 4 minus and here will another EDTA 3 minus and 4 minus but here we will take EDTA 3 minus its full form is ethylene diamine triacetato triacetato structure is your this is the NH this is the CS2 CS2 this is the N one of the acetato group COO with the negative charge CS2 COO with the negative charge this is the lone pair this is the lone pair and here we will see S2 CO and this is the O with 3 lone pair negative charge charge is your in front of you this is the minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 3 charge and just donor atom one of the oxygen this nitrogen 2 another nitrogen 3 oxygen 4 and this one is your 5 this was regarding to just your pentadentate ligand now we will go with the final type of the just polydentate ligand that is your hexadentate ligands hexadentate ligands you can say having donor atom donor atom as a 6 regarding to this we will take example of EDTA it was 3 minus and here will EDTA 4 minus the name is ethylene ethylene diamine ethylene diamine tri here was tri so here will tetraacetato tetraacetato ethylene diamine tetraacetato if we we'll go with the structure then we can take as follows this is the CH2 this is the CS2 this is your N this is your N these are the two valences of the nitrogen CS2 CO this is the O having just we can remove it like this this will be as follows so this is the CO O donor atom this is the minus donor atom 1 donor atom 2 donor atom 3 and donor atom 4 another oxygen having the negative charge donor atom this is the CS2 CO O negative this is the donor atom and CS2 this is the CO and O negative so this carry charge as a minus 1 minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 and minus 4 that's why it is 4 minus EDTA 4 minus and the donor atom is one of the oxygen another 2 3 nitrogen 4 nitrogen 5 oxygen and 6 oxygen so donor atom is 6 so this was about the just types of the ligand as a polydentate ligand tridentate, tetradentate, pentadentate and hexadentate ligand is that clear? Now the time to discuss about the fourth type of the ligand that is the MP, MP or MB 
डेंटेट लिगेंट्स एमपी मीन्स यू कैन से एमपी बेन की तरह नेचर टू टाइप की हो बट एट ए टाइम एक ही नेचर शो करता है सो यू कैन से लिगेंट्स हैविंग टू डॉलर एटम्स टू डॉलर एटम्स बट एट ए टाइम एट अ टाइम ओनली वन एटम डोनेट्स लॉन्ग पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन लॉन्ग पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन दो हजार नॉन एट जस्ट एम्पीडेंटेट लिगेंट इफ यू गो विद एग्जाम्पल देन अगर पर्टिकुलर कार्बन डोनेट करे लॉन्ग पेयर को दिस इज द मेटल आइटम देन दिस इज कॉल्ड एज साइनिडो जबकि लॉन्ग पेयर नाइट्रोजन पे प्रेजेंट है सो इट्स एम्पीडेंटेट लिगेंट विल बी नाइट्रोजन डोनेट करे देन इट विल बी आइसो साइनिडो सो साइनिडो के लिए आइसो साइनिडो एम्पीडेंटेट लिगेंट का काम करेगा अगर पर्टिकुलर एनो टू में नाइट्रोजन डोनेट करें लाइक दिस नाइट्रोजन डोनेट करें देन इट विल बी नाइट्रो और अगर इफ डोनर एटम इज ऑक्सीजन देन इट विल बी नाइट्रीटो इफ यू गो विद एंड बोथ ऑफ देम आर जस्ट नेगेटिवली चार्ज मोनोडेंटिटी कैन ऑल्सो इफ आई गो विद जस्ट फर्दर देन डोनर एटम इज सल्फर then it is called as thio cyanato and if donor atom is your nitrogen then iso thio cyanato so this was about the entire part of the ligand in this video we'll meet in the next video till then shukriya dhanyawad but one thing is important by using this kind of this just channel as a chemistry wala वीकर से वीकर स्टूडेंट और स्ट्रॉगेस्ट स्ट्रॉगेस्ट स्टूडेंट अपने बेसिक फंडों को क्लियर कर सकता है स्टे विद मी स्टे टू थैंक यू धन्यवाद शुक्रिया